this is Calm and welcome to a Minecraft Red Spray video and another video inside of Calm's epic world. Good morning, William. Morning, Calm. Good morning, Fizzy Pig. Morning, Calm. And good morning, Polly Reindeer as well. Morning, Calm. So I'll be joined by William Polly and Fizzy today because we'll be building a brand new mini game. I'm actually, really, I'm actually really excited for this one. So yeah, it's basically about a wood, like wood themed game. Wait, what? What do you mean, wood themed? Yeah, that actually makes no sense whatsoever. Yeah. Anyway, I'll explain it to you guys properly when we go over there. But anyway, I'll meet you guys over the phone line in just one second. Hi, right, bro. Hi, right, buddy. Bye, bro. Bye, guys. All right, let's go have my breakfast, which is going to be a shock. Uh, I said, I don't know why I keep saying it. A shock to no one. A cake. I don't know why I keep saying that, but it just sticks, I guess. Uh, num, 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 Delicious. All right, let's head downstairs and say good morning to every brother downstairs. Good morning, Rook. Good morning, Ruben. And good morning, Powered as well. So let's go head straight over to the doghouse. And I, if I can jump over the damn fence. <laughs> oh, jeez. Um... Yeah, I will, I will explain the minigame. It's a bit of a different one. It's one that I've seen that other people, other YouTubers I've known do, I've done before. I will explain uh, that in a, minute, in a little bit, though. Uh, where, hmm, how about we have Stripey? Stripey, you can join me, and... Uh, who else could join me today? Uh, hmm, uh, you know what? Fluffy, you can join me today. And then, yeah, let's get over to the fun and let's get start building because um, it's not a particularly big mini game, but I want to get it done so I can test it out. So I can, because I always love testing mini games out when we do them, like when I first build them, because it gives you guys a good enough idea for the tournament in the following episode. And yeah, it just makes life a hell of a lot easier. Anyway, good morning, Office Cat, and also good morning, Teleporter, as well. I just noticed, why do I say good morning to a teleporter? It's literally a, f a device. Anyway, it doesn't matter. So we flick the lever up and down, hit button number two today, and then we set it off to the Funland. Right, we should be over the Funland now, and it looks like we are beautiful. Oh, hi, Blake. <laughs> uh, looks like you decided to join us today. Um, I've actually never took uh, Blake out for an episode before. I, mean, I don't know why, I just have too many dogs. Uh, some, some dogs I just take quite a few times, and others I just forget about. I don't know why, it's just... It's hard to keep track with all the dogs. <laughs> Oh, hi guys. Hi, Calum. So, buddy, so, bro. So, um, yeah, we're pretty much building right over here, so I need to sit you guys down. So, Stripey, for oh, yeah, you guys can have some rotten fresh. Um, Alright, so, yeah, we're pretty much building out of these materials, pretty much. So, yeah, this would be easy as hell to build. So, what the game is, is like, remember when I said earlier, it was made, um, I've seen my other YouTube brothers, um, do a game like this before. I wasn't kidding. Basically, a fellow you uh, one of my other fellow YouTuber compadres, Bloodstorm06, made a game about this uh years ago, like I'm not sure like a few years ago, like it was it might have been a one year ago, two years ago, one of the two. But yeah, it was quite a while ago, so yeah, this is kind of based on the game he did, like kind of obviously it's not copied because obviously I'm an honourable guy like that. I don't I don't copy people's mini games and this is way too big. I realise that now, but hey ho, it doesn't matter. Um it's way bigger than a four it was, and do do not take that out of context, please someone. <laughs> um alright, let's put that there and then um you know we'll go there. The game could just be a bit uh, bigger than usual than it's meant to be, but hey ho. Um, so pretty much what this game is, is about a race. It's basically about stripping wood blocks. Well, logs, more or less. So what you basically have to try and do is um, strip loads of, like, oak wood blocks. Well, just blocks, right, before the other person does. So it's mainly like a 1v1 game, but other people could just play this as well. So it doesn't really matter in the end. Um, so yeah, well, that's pretty much that done, I guess. Um, so let's, let's get rid of all these flowers, and then let's get started on the floor. And then, yeah, we this won't take too long to do because there's not even much to this. All it basically is is basically, um, I said basically like twice then. <laughs> All they basically it three times. Um, it's basically you go oh four times. There's gonna be like a wood block space we place all around the, um, the the arena over here, and basically the first person to strip as many oh um, strip basically strip as many um, blocks as possible wins. I know like I'm like I know I mentioned this now, but it's like. But with uh, Bloodstorm's idea, it's not the most original thing ever, but I want to do a minigame like this for like quite a long time. But it just I just I, I wanted to do it, but like the fact that he already did it kinda of, like turned me off the idea. But now like I was really like running out of mini minigame ideas to do and I don't even really want to like repeat anything. 
I would only repeat minigame ideas if it's a sequel or I'm really struggling, but this is like my last free idea I've got left, like for now at least. So, yeah, that's just what we have to roll with. Uh, so, yeah, <laughs> that's just what we have to roll with. So, but some of you watching this, uh, thanks for the idea, bro. Um, yeah, I'm not doing this on purpose, I'm just doing it because of the. Um, yeah, I, I, I just wanted to do this game for a few years, ever since he first did it in his Fantastic World, but I kind of like, um, like, like I said earlier, I didn't want to like do it because he already made a game like this, uh, but yeah, uh, but with his version, you have to, it's basically like a team to strip your own logs, this time around is basically to see who's going to just strip any type of log. Uh, because there's like, I remember in his version there was like a crimson and uh, the red one from like the nether, I forgot what it was called. A crimson and what is face, I forgot the other wood, but it's like the the blue and red wood. From like, the, the like one of the newer updates, well not really newer, but when I'm recording this is still quite new. But, yeah, that's basically my, uh, not situation, but, yeah, I just wanted to say like, I wanted to do this game for a while, but I just never got around to it, because obviously, well... I was thinking about it for quite a long time, I just didn't want to do it because he already made a game like this, and yeah. You can kind of see where I'm getting at over here, but yeah. I hope it'll be pretty good fun anyway, but his ver like I said, his version's got like blue and red wood, but mine is just going to be the normal oak wood. So this is going to be like the one of the only oak things in my fun land so far, like... I don't think there's like many oak, oak games in my fun land, is there guys? Um, well, you've got the dog race course. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, me too. But apart from that, I don't think you have many oak games. You mainly, like, use, like, different colours. Yeah, I usually, like, use di different, like, concrete and wool and stuff like that. So, yeah, but, yeah, it should be pretty fun anyway. So, alright, so now we've got the floor um, out of the way. So, yeah, this was going to be a bit smaller, but I thought, like, it doesn't matter about the size of it. Like, it was going to be, like, like, four rows worth of, like, um, oak... Um, well, logs to to use, but yeah, it doesn't really matter. Like, it didn't. I did, for me, it didn't really matter. Like how like big it was or anything like that. So I just, I just found it fun. Like, and like, and the, and the design of it. It's like, like the design of it doesn't really matter. Like, this is one of the games where I don't really mind about the design not looking great because um, yeah, I just didn't mind it as much. I don't know why. I just didn't really mind it too much to be honest this time around. Um, because I always try to get my mini games like, like may uh, the, my mini games may not look appealing, but I want to at least make them so the people can look at them and say, like, oh, no, that's an alright thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But with this game, Carl, all you're basically doing is stripping wood. What do you need? Like, you can't really make like too much of a um, crazy design with this. Yeah, you're right there, Fizzy. Uh, that was like the thing I was like questioning the most. Um, on like what how to do this because I was like huh, I was actually like I was actually gonna think of like a proper design to do for this but I was like hmm should I or should I not yeah there's no point in going out of the way to do like something major like all you're basically doing is stripping wood blocks or like a little bit yeah that's what I was thinking but you know you know what I'm like I always try to overcomplicate things well not all the time but some of the time I always try to like make things look nicer yeah fair enough but yeah, you don't need to worry about that this time around, I don't think. Yeah, I hope so. Right, anyway, so we'll just build this across over here, like so. And, yeah, I've actually been wanting to fill a game in this area for a long time. Because, like, this area has just been empty for the longest time possible. And, yeah, it's just been the most annoying thing ever. But, yeah. But, alright, so we're pretty much nearly done with this. But, yeah, it's so satisfying now that I've actually got a game to fit in this area. Alright, so now we're going to have to f add in the door. So, where do you think the door is? So, it's going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. If I get this right, I'm going to I'm gonna just... I don't know. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Oh, you melon. Oh, I was so close. So, on the edges, we're going to have the... Um, we're going to have some oak blocks. I don't know. It just makes it look a bit nicer and a bit neater and all that stuff. So... And we'll do the same for the middle as well, actually, so... Um, we'll just fill this in, and we'll just have to go in a straight line for the middle on each side. Just, I don't know why, just to make it look a bit nicer, to be honest. Um, let's try and find out the middle. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... 
Uh, we won't count the end because reasons. Nine and then uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There we go. That was perfect. <laughs> and then we go. Uh, is this in the middle? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> I was going to that and then plonk this down like so and then do this. I can always change it after the video. It's not like a major problem. It's just, um, it's just some decoration at this point. So, and there you go. That's pretty much like the, pretty much the main game done. So, basically, all we basically need to do now is add the logs in. So, the logs are going to be kind of spread up. So, you're going to go from here. One, two, and it's going to go, it's like, start around here. And they're going to be like, two like every two gaps so it's like this and then this and then this and then like up to there so it's gonna be like that and then we're gonna go uh three back and then we're gonna do the exactly the same so yeah we can spread these out as much as possible because obviously with the game being that big it doesn't matter and uh a zombie's attacking poly so you might want to be careful guys ow god damn it i can't see a bloody thing <laughs> Is it? Oh, for a second there, you looked like, uh, it looks like Polly was wearing your clothes, William. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, there you go, so that's pretty much up to there, and then, yeah, we pretty much just bring this across, and then, yeah, that'll be pretty much, uh, this game, uh, done. So, yeah, I knew it wouldn't take long. We will do, like, a, a quick test of game, we won't do, like, a major one or anything like that. I think this will only be good as a one-player, uh, two-player game, but we'll see, like, um, this game might be the one of the only times we actually do like a 1v1 like tournament on it. So, yeah, we'll see. Um, I might change my mind on that, but we'll see. Um, we'll rent these up like so. Uh... Oh, hold up. I placed it wrong. Uh, there we go. So, yeah, that's pretty much the game finished. I know there's like a bit of a bit of a gap over here, but it doesn't actually matter. So, where you would get these... Uh, I thought I saw a phantom there. Oh, I was not kidding. God damn it. Um, where should we sleep anyway? It's only day. Oh, yeah, fair enough. Oh, just, I wanted to sleep. I want night, but never mind. Alright, so let's make a crafting table. I was about to say, have anyone got any wood? Like, I'm literally building out of it. I know, you melon. And then we're going to put a chest there, and then we're going to put all these oak logs in here just for as a backup so we can reset the game, and all of these axes, but I can't fit them in yet. Um, I actually don't know what the name of the game is going to be yet. Usually I have a pretty good idea of what it is that we're going to do, but this time I actually don't. <laughs> so, yeah, you're just going to have to keep an eye out for the next episode, because the next episode's title is probably going to be what the game's going to be called, because uh, that's mainly my, um, what's it called? That's usually how I do things around here. Um, I will just... Put all these away, and then, and then, yeah, we can have a quick test of game. So, yeah, that didn't take us long as I thought. Um, all right, so who want? We'll do like one test of game. How about that? Uh, yeah. Or we could just do like two, like have two goes, like one. Say it was like me against you, and then William against Fizzy. Yeah, we could do that actually. So, um, William and Fizzy, do you want to go first? Uh, nope. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fine. <laughs> Why do you not want to go first for William? Uh, because I don't want to. I hate being. I hate the pressure. What pressure? You're actually stripping wood. <laughs> oh, fine. Oh, don't be such a uh, a pansy, man. So you just have to. I'll use my axe for this because it doesn't actually matter. And then probably I'll give you an axe as well. And then yeah, I just have to. I just need them back after the video, because obviously you need to reset the game. So yeah, the game's pretty much all ready for you guys to go, pretty much. So, yeah, one get, one person can start on this side, and the other person can start on the other side. So it's pretty much the, the first person to actually strip all the wood blocks would win the game. Yeah, where's William gone? <laughs> he does not want to do this. I do, I'm just a bit tired. Uh, fair enough. Alright, uh, we'll begin in three, two, one, go, 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 go. Wait, hold up. How do you strip hit the left trigger, William? <laughs> He doesn't actually know. Oh, that's hilarious. Oh, Fizzy's doing well so far. Oh, 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 this is actually pretty good. Oh, William's doing loads now. Now he's actually, like, um, woke up from his riddle sleep. <laughs> he's actually doing pretty good. Oh, Fizzy's done, like, a whole two of them over here. So, um, it's either William or Fizzy who's going to get these two over here. Oh, 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 Fizzy stole that from him. Jesus. <laughs> 
Alright, so how many f points did Fizzy get? So he went up to, like, here. Yeah, this is, like, the last one I stripped. So it was, like, um, you got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 points. Well, Fizzy got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15 points. So Fizzy wins that one. Yay! <laughs> hey, this game's pretty easy. Yeah, all you're basically doing is spamming a left trigger, and then you're in the queer, <laughs> Fizzy. And then, uh, let me just... Oh, God, I didn't mean to break the floor, then. Um, I'll do this, and then me and Polly will have a go. And then, yeah, that'll be pretty much it for this, uh, for this game. Uh, and for, the, for now, are we? So, yeah, William, how did you find that? They're pretty good, actually. Actually, I actually, it was pretty easy. But, yeah, pretty much all you're doing is stripping wood, so... Yeah, it would be easy, but... Yeah, I'm glad you found it fun. Because, yeah, obviously you were a bit tired because you've been, you've been mining today, haven't you? Yeah. <laughs> and then, yeah, you just go, um, you guys can have a sit down now while um, I reset the game. And obviously, um, me and Polly will have a go. I think the, this, the biggest pain of this game is going to be the uh, resetting the game part of it. But, yeah, it doesn't really matter too much. And then we go, uh, yeah, two away from there. Boom, 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 and then boom, and then boom. Yeah, this is kind of the most annoying task of the whole game, but it has to be done. Um, because no one else is going to goddamn do it, are they? <laughs> um, yeah, I need to make sure these are two block back. And then um, one, two... Yeah, so one there, one there, uh, one... Nope, one there. <laughs> I need to make sure I don't get confused with um, how many blocks are back and then how many are over here and then, yeah, all that stuff. And then, yeah, we just wank this up with the other side. And, yeah, that won't take too long. And then, yeah... And then that'll be pretty much it. So, yeah, this will, this will pretty much give you a good enough idea of what the game's like. So, in the next episode, whether we do this as a 1v1 or not, I feel like we should. Like, I feel like this is like the only game we do that actually is, should be a 1v1 game. But we'll see. Uh, we'll see what goes down. And, yeah, that's pretty much the game reset. So, uh, probably whenever you're ready, you can go um, on to the other side. So, I'll go from this side. I'll use my axe, but... It doesn't actually matter what I use. I did not the Chapman doesn't really like matter too much. Alright, so Polly, are you ready to begin? Uh yeah, let's do this. Right, we begin in three, two, one, go. Oh, oh hoo -hoo. All right, so I need to I need to try and strip all these wood quick, but Polly's on PC though, so I might use that to my advantage. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, so um Oh I might be But the thing is I'm on I'm on Xbox, so I'm a bit quicker than she is, so I might be able to use that to my advantage. Oh, God damn it. I just nearly broke the wood block. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, okay. So, we're getting me and Polly getting quite close to each other now. So, um, we're just uh, boom, boom, and then boom. Oh, balls. So, how many points was that? So, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then seven, eight. And then I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen points. So, yeah, that would declare me the winner of that round. God damn it. <laughs> Yeah, but Paul, you are a bit laggy. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty much how this game is played. So yeah, so I do recommend coming back in the next episode for the tournament because I'm actually looking forward to this one. Um, I don't know why it's just so stupid, but it's pretty fun as well. I don't know why I'm building stupid mini games recently. Like the concept of them is a bit stupid, but anyway. But yeah, that's pretty much going to be the end of this episode here. I hope you really have enjoyed it. I want to say thank you to William, Polly, and Fizzy for joining me in this video. You can go home. Like a buddy. Like a blow. Hope you tune back in the next episode, like I said, to to, to see how this tournament goes. But yeah, um, that's going to be the end of this one here. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye.